First of all, welcome to all of you. Good morning. Thank you for all being here at the uh, early hours of today. But we have a <coughs> uh, we have an announcement today with respect to uh, fuel prices, and uh, it's a pleasure to announce today that uh, there'll be a decrease in in fuel and LPG prices across the board, um, uh, as uh, which will come into effect from Friday, the 1st of May. Um, one of the, the reasons behind this particular uh, decrease in price is actually, um, this is, it, it stems from, uh, from a shift in focus of the majority of the countries that have been pushed into taking strong measures uh, to contain the COVID-19 health crisis and given its fast spread. The pandemic has actually uh, prompted economies major economies into lockdowns, as you all know, imposing like severe tra travel restrictions in international travel history and, and maintaining social distancing to combat the spread of COVID-19. The impact obviously has been felt directly on global economic activities and uh, uh, it's abruptly slowing it down as well as there's a significant oil demand contraction, predominantly in transportation fuels like jet fuel and, and uh, gasoline and diesel, etc. And the decline in global oil demand is actually projected to continue uh, over the first half of, of 2020. On our domestic front, <coughs> the increase in the global prices has allowed us, uh, like many others, to take advantage of, of the lower fuel prices. And one thing you must remember with respect to Fiji, we actually lag, and if you understand the term, we are actually now getting the benefits of something that happened uh, a little while ago. Mm -hmm. So the immediate, uh, if you go backwards, what happened last week, we will feel the effects a little later. So there's likely to be a, a decrease, even more so, in uh, June. June or so, something like that. So good news for, for consumers and, and on the domestic front. Um, it will also mean it's good for Fijian businesses. It's also good for our our taxi drivers, our bus companies, our inter-island vessels and, and local airlines who are experiencing slow business due to COVID-19. Um, specifically with respect to the, the actual uh, prices that come into effect, uh, with respect to fuel, fuel prices, Motor Spirit will uh, go from $2.06 to $1.80 per litre, which is a decrease of 26 cents. Uh, per liter and it equates to about 12.62 percent. Premix will go from a dollar ninety to a dollar forty-three, um, and that, that's a decrease of 47 cents per liter, or 24.74 percent. Kerosene will go from one dollar forty-seven uh, to one dollar eight per liter, uh, which is an increase of uh, or decrease of 39 cents per liter, or 26.53 percent. And diesel will go from a dollar seventy one to one dollar sixty seven uh, per liter and that's a decrease of, of four cents. LPG and this is applicable to everybody who has of all homes, four point five kg cylinder from fourteen dollars forty three down to fourteen dollars three cents. That's a decrease of forty cents. A twelve kg cylinder will be from th uh, thirty eight dollars forty seven to thirty seven dollars forty two and that's a decrease of a dollar five. Bulk from two dollars uh, two dollars uh, sixty four cents a kg to two dollars sixty a kg, and that's a decrease of four cents. Auto gas per liter from a dollar seventy eight to a dollar seventy four, and that's a decrease of four cents. So you now consumers will obviously be able to take advantage of it. I'm also um, I think the industry stakeholders, as I said earlier, transport etc. They'd be it's a it's good timing, although it's coming out of a bad period at the end of the day. But I encourage all, all the uh, members of the public, obviously this is good, but at the same time everybody probably needs to save and uh, with all the restrictions that are on, there's less transport going out and about at all times at the moment. But uh, stay safe and continue to look out for your family and your friends. Thank you very much. <laughs>